Hey, yo, what is up, guys? It's your boy, Tenyo Sin one and today we're back with yet another tutorial video. Um, now, it's been really long, I know. Um, I'll get to that later, but yeah, I've, I've been trying to get more videos out, but nonetheless, um, a lot of people have been having issues uh, with, with, with the uh, bullet spreading, which is basically that in some directions the bullet spreads fine and in, in in other directions it's just like not working at all um so this is a major coding fault uh, i don't know why i did it that way i i didn't notice at, at start it was, it was really bad on my part but basically we're going to be fixing that we're going to be taking a look how it works and fixing that today uh so without any further ado let's get right on to it So as you can see on the left side, um, when I shoot straight, it works. But when I go around the wall and I shoot like in a different direction, it doesn't work, and it's only spreading um, on the y-axis instead of the x-axis. But on the right side, it's actually working. So basically, this is what we're going to look at, take a look into and see how we can fix that. Now the reason why we were having that issue was basically because we were adding the spread factor in terms of the world space. Now what is world space? Basically, I, I believe I did explain this in a previous video as well, but basically, you can see here, this is the object, and I've unparented from, from the weapon and stuff. This is my shoot point, and if I move it on the x-axis, it's moving on the x-axis. Move it on the y-axis, you can see the values in the y-axis are changing, and you know, so on and so forth. And basically this is the world space. World space is like an actual 3D space, which is like the, the universal, you could say the global space, where all the objects exist. We're not talking about parented, we're not talking about child objects, we're talking about all the, all the parents, all the root objects. Um, and basically what we, what we were doing is we were adding uh, the spread factor on the x-axis, in this case, this axis. So what happens is that when you move about, so when I rotate this like 90 degrees, say, um, and I go back to the, you can see the x-axis is still there. There is no change in it whatsoever. Um, and that is not a glitch, it's not a problem. It is how it's supposed to be because globally, this object is gonna stay the same. The, its rotation is not gonna affect its positional values. Um, because it's, you know, we're, we're thinking of this as a world space object. But we don't want it to exist in the world space. We don't wanna add the spread factor in the world space, we want to add it in the local space, which means we have to translate our local values to the global values. So for example, and now this is in the local space because it's a child of, of these objects. If I move it left and right, you can see the values are changing, right? And if I were to rotate the whole object, um, the values, of course, remain as, as they should. They remain perfectly fine. If I switch to local, you can see this is its local orientation now. Um, and the way basically you fix it is instead of adding it directly to the shoot points as I did here X and Y um, what you do is basically you get you get your shoot direction which is in this case transformed forward uh, you pick that shoot direction you add shoot point or transform direction now what this does is converts as you can see it converts uh, the values from local space to world space basically it's going to translate your um, assigned values. So basically if I'm saying, hey, I want to move it this much to the left, it's going to move it left, but with respect to its parent. So it's not going to ignore the parent values. This is the parent, and it's going to move it uh, a little bit like this in respect to its parent. And basically that's all we're doing with the transfer direction. We're just giving it those same values uh, with transformed direction, and that is it simple as that and that way it actually respects so if you save this it actually is, is respects the the parent and it does not mess this up in different various orientations and positions let's go ahead and give it a try you can see it's working no problems whatsoever anyways uh, that's all about it um i hope you guys uh found this useful this was longer than i expected but yeah uh, have a good one and um i will get back to making more videos uh, proper videos, of course, uh, soon. 
really trying to get to it. There's a lot going on in my life, uh, and and there's a lot of decisions I have to make. Uh, but yeah, I'm gonna get this in track. I really need to. Uh, I do want to get to the live streaming for some reason, and get more ideas and actually interact with my audience because uh, most of the audience on, on Discord are really not that active, unfortunately. So yeah. Um, anyways, hope you guys enjoy, and um, I'll see you in the next. I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.